right, guys, we are here with uh, who you wanted. We've got Mo himself. So, Mo, congratulations on winning, man. Uh, had to feel great to take this. It feels really good. You know, after, that, after we played that map, we uh, took him out on, I believe it was Inferno. Inferno, you know, they yeah. thought They were very confident on it. After that win, you know, we all just left, picked up, and apparently, I think the land kept going up for some reason. I think Sex Pistols was playing for us. Oh, Sex, and sex Pistols not was playing for you guys. Yeah. That's what I heard. I came back, and they're on our computers, and I guess uh, Dynamic and Chris thought they won or something. Misunderstanding. It was the best of one. Did they not realize? Yeah, that? they did not know that. That's so we were at Buffalo Wild Wings watching the football game. Like, what's going on, guys? I don't. I don't understand. I don't understand. You guys either. won fair and square, right? <laughs> the best of one. Uh, yeah, yeah. Is, is that what? We. That's that's what I'm gonna use. Yeah. That's the excuse I'm going with for the rest. Yeah, of the it time. wasn't. I don't. I don't know, guys. Personally, Mo says he wasn't there. I streamed it. There's no I proof. Was, There's no proof. That there I was is there. no proof. I I didn't see any pictures. Picture didn't happen. So. Um, <laughs> no, but all kidding aside, Mo, um, you know, appreciate you coming along. We were just oh, having no a little fun with you guys on stream. Hope you guys enjoyed that. Uh, but, you know, take us through this. You know, obviously, those guys were a pug. I mean, they are a pug, you yeah. know, but they're very, very talented individuals. Yeah. They have tons of they, experience. They really have, like, a, as a CT-sided team, they have really no weakness because yeah. every player on that team can aim. Sure. So we dismantled them on Inferno because we already played them on Inferno, so we knew what to expect. So that's why we were able to dominate them so badly on Inferno. On Mirage, we just simply were not hitting our shots, and you know it's it's part you know the blame is on us for not adjusting right away because we have we played them on Mirage earlier in the in the term the very first time we played right. them was on Mirage, yeah. and it was a 16, 13, 16, 14. So we should have uh, adapted faster, and it, it just they're the very momentum based. They win, and they just keep going and going, and you gotta we gotta break them somehow, and we weren't able to do it, and then we were really confident going into new because we've been undefeated on it, but. Again, you know, they started CT, and I congratulate them because their their CTs they're just they just have veteran players that know how to hold their spot, and that's really new. All you need is to uh, know how to hold your spot. Sure. Basically, they eliminated our rushes with their mollies, and other teams. I think if they were a team, they probably would have done worse with their actual teams. Really, think honestly, so? on on nuke, I think so. Okay, well, talk us through this. You know, Mirage was a tough map. You guys, you guys played them very strong the first time you played them. Obviously. Yeah. Um, Freakazoid accidentally hitting F10, dropping yeah, the game, kind of cost the first match. Yeah. So, you know, you guys go into Mirage, probably being very confident because you played them so well the first time, and already getting that win on Inferno, which you said yesterday was even your worst map. Yeah. So take us through this. You, you, you win the first map, you lose on Mirage, now you've got to start T-side on Nuke. How does that play with the Psyche? It's honestly, uh, we, we really, the way I said it is on, when we were losing on Mirage, I already told them like this is even. We're going on. We're we have another map after this. We can do this. As soon as nuke happened, you know, it's really it was pretty much coming down to the knife round. We both both teams wanted CT side, and we just suck at knifing. So <laughs> we, uh, we as, as C is just from that pistol, we realized that it's going to be tough because you know when you win pistol, we built some rounds, you know, and we were only able to manage one round, yeah. which I still thought we could be possibly yeah. make a comeback, but. They were just hitting their eco shots. They, they, I think they blocked us for the win. You know, like they didn't even need to use guns. But I, you know, I really had faith that we could uh, maybe bring it back. You know, 14-1, 0 because we did that. We have, you know, we have a com have had comebacks like that on this sure. land. But overall, I'm really happy with the team performance. We won it first. Um, it just didn't happen. Yeah. Sometimes that that's part of competitiveness. Yeah. Sometimes you win, you lose. You know. But, you know, it is a testament to have that attitude towards things because a lot of times players will get down on themselves, get down on their teams, and they'll try to make adjustments that really just don't need to happen. Yeah. So, you know, congratulations to second Thank place. You. Second place is, is, is a very big deal. $1,500 is what uh, Frost Gaming will actually take home. So, uh, Mo, I'm going to leave you with a, a, a shout-out. If you want to shout out to uh, yeah, I just want to, like, then thank Frost Gaming for sending us, believing in us. And I just want to thank Ryu for hosting this land and you guys for covering it really well. And I just, you know, I've been having a lot. We've had a lot of support for this land so far in terms of outside support. And I hope that the community as a whole, if you know, if Ryu decides another land sometime in the near future, that we all actually do it and show up because this land deserved at least 16 teams. It was that it's well ran. Um, computers were amazing. Monitors were, eh, but everyone was on an even playing field. But sure. source, I mean, uh, CS:GO on LAN is a really fun. It's ten times better than online. Yeah. And I, I'm almost pissed that I have to go back to online play now. <laughs> you know, but sure. you know, hopefully, I see we see more of these LANs happening everywhere. Definitely. All right, guys, there you go. You have it from Mo. Uh, we'll try to come back one more interview. We'll try to bring on uh, Mr. Ryu.